since he is, always tells the story. Is, um, so this is what a story we know of how we about, met. Like, you know, uh, moving to California or, you know, going across country and, and you could give her some advice and I'll, I'll, you know, I'll take you to lunch and you, know, you guys can, you know, talk about it at lunch. Like, Sure, sure, why not? Yeah, free I mean, food. It's always at the, you know, like, hey, free food from a recruiter. Because recruiters are always doing that, right? Like, they, oh. They're always trying to get you to, you know, get onto the vendor list and so on, right? Yeah. And so, the vendor list there, is where you can give and, employees for the company. And then I'm sitting down with the recruiter lady, and then Sue walks in. I didn't walk and I tripped. I fell. And she her. literally. I had high into heels. Me. I fell for him, literally. Yeah. Yeah. I was all dressed up in a skirt and, and high heels. Yep. <laughs> I was late because I had a client meeting, and I actually forgot, and Elizabeth called me and said, are you coming? And I was like, yes. <laughs> the hell is she talking about? I forgot because I ran my own business, oh. and I was trying to do everything by myself. Yeah, as a lawyer, so wow. I went to this Bravo in Rochester Hills, a beautiful outdoor restaurant. We're outdoors, no, we're indoors. Indoors. And I walked in, and I see Elizabeth. She was the most gorgeous girl. She had the most beautiful tall and skin, she and, was a and the wow. she model was looking. And men would just kill to be around her. She was wow. like Farrah Fawcett, like level, oh, like just wow. yes, men loved her. Wow. So anyway. I was her lawyer for anything she needed, personal business, whatever. Oh. So then I go in and I see Rod sitting there and I just get so overwhelmed because <laughs> it was actually handsome, like really handsome. Because she had told me he's real good looking and he takes care of himself. He uses lotion, he does his nails. And I go, was he gay? Because he always takes care of himself. He takes baths, not yeah. just shower. He's Michigan. He had nothing else to do. So I was like, that's yeah. weird. So I walk in and he was so handsome and I got like a little flustered. And I just like lost my weight and I tripped and I fell over like onto him. He's like, Can I help you? And then I said, You have really long fingers. Do you play piano? Because I always think of that because my dad plays piano my whole life. And he was like, What did you say? I said, Well, I used to. And, and I thought, that was weird. That was weird. So we had a really nice lunch. But, but so we're, we're, we're having lunch and we're talking and we're. You know, talking about, you know, work and so on. And, and I was... And the, the meal's over, right? And, and then we get I, the bill I, I, and we I leave. get the bill. We, we're walking outside. We leave. And the, <laughs> this is where it gets a little gray. Yeah. Where, so, <laughs> said, and I say gray as in... He so, says so, that I... She, she literally said, oh, you know, we should probably... Exchange like, numbers. You know, exchange numbers. That's, I probably like, said oh, that. Yeah, okay, sure, okay. Right? Again, I'm not thinking anything other than, you know, like this. He's like, she life. wants I'm, advice on California. Business, business, that's yeah. it, right? right. And, you know, because I don't know. And Elizabeth kept setting gosh. me up with people. Yeah. Elizabeth right. always set me up with men, and I never liked any of them. Like, I just, doctors, I don't care what they do. But, I just was like, but, I'm but, not into him, and she was, thought that's weird. But, but, right, but, but, right. I, 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 I go and I get in my car and I'm thinking, that's weird. We didn't talk anything about California, yeah. driving across the country, yeah. or transitioning to California, or anything. Like, I'm like, but here's what I get. And forgive me in advance. I'm like, well, you know, women are weird. Like, whatever. Like, she, yeah, he's about like, that was weird. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. I, you know, and it then... was a good, good lunch. I'll go back to work now. And so finally, you know, she calls me. Wait, wait. When you were walking away, you look back, and I look back. Yeah. I was walking away. I was super far, and he was far. And then I just looked back, and he looked back. I was like, mm, he likes me. <laughs> so she, but here's the thing. So she calls me, and like, hey, it, it, it was not, hey, let's go out. It was, hey, I'm thinking about going to the mall and do some shopping. What are you doing? I'm like, you want to yeah, go to the I'll mall? Go. There's nothing to do in Michigan. Yeah, so I said, I'll meet you at the mall. You either eat, drink, or smoke, and I didn't do any of those. So I was like, I'll meet you at the mall. (laughs) Don't come to my house. I didn't invite men over to my place because you don't know. You can't trust you. No. You're in your, I mean, you're vulnerable. So So I said, I'll meet you at the mall. I'm like, no, no, no. I'll meet you there. I'm like, all right, sure. So I'm like, all independent. I'll meet you at the mall. So, oh, yeah. Do not so come to my like, house. I wasn't really? thinking this was like a date. I had guys try to trick me right. when I would meet them at the bar in like Birmingham, like downtown. You know, They say, oh, I have to use the bathroom. Can I come back with you to your place? I go use the bathroom. I said, no. You can't come to my place. That's like weird. Mm. Yeah, no, so, never. So literally, we started, we started doing this, and it would be like every week. 
Well, like, hey, I'm thinking about going to the mall. I'm like, sure, I guess. And I was a clothes just town kept in Michigan going. because that's all I could do is right. buy more clothes. <laughs> I had all kinds of clothes, right? And so so we just... It was, it was Mrs. Fields cookies and because they were both at the mall. The yeah, clothes and the... Yeah, 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 and clothes. So right? we ended up... And then it was a couple of weeks of this, and I was starting to think, like, huh, we always meet there. I never figure out. We never actually go out. I wonder crazy. if she thinks I've her day shopping. I did friend. just get oh, all. Right? I just oh, was. Oh, yeah. And I literally went to myself and went, Yeah, well, at least she's not media. It's fine with me, whatever. I don't care. I'm, I'm so I wasn't media, no. I don't care. I, <laughs> no. So we said, and, and then it, you know. And then, it. yeah. And then, um. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So yeah. That's, yeah. Uh, that's how it started. Date? Yeah. Well, no, not until finally. way later. Not until. I had to ask him, Do you want kids? Because I didn't know. Because I can't be arguing about it later. So we well, went to what dinner. Did you ask like, yeah, you maybe kids. like six or seven. We finally went for a nice dinner. Date? No, no, like the seventh no, date. No, no, then no, I no, said, let's no, go no. to the restaurant. Oh, we went to a nice restaurant. Here, Holly. Yeah, right. <laughs> we went to a nice <laughs> restaurant in, in downtown Birmingham called Cameron's Steakhouse. And I said, do you want kids? But you know what the mistake I made? What? I didn't ask him how many. Oh, I was a bad no, lawyer. I wanted four, but I got two, and they're amazing. Okay, and he has I, two already, you so. Have four. Yeah, we have two sons older. It's part of the package deal. Oh, right, but I'm just right. saying, I, he said he same wanted you, kids, and then I said, okay, I can date him. Like, yeah, you are. <laughs> Once he said kids, then I was like, okay, because you never know. Like, some people don't want kids. That's how it works. Yeah. And I can't argue about it later. Yeah. No. Because I was ready yeah. to package split. Deal. Oh. I would have been like, pay for my drink. Bye. Mm-hmm. Bye, boy. Yeah. So we went on an actual <laughs> date. You did? And yeah. Oh, we oh. We went is... to P.F. Chang's. You did? At the yeah. mall, Somerset Mall. <laughs> well, we just, Troy, it's probably mutual. Really at the mall. Yeah, yeah at the mall, oh, P.F. Chang's. Oh. Yeah. yeah. So we went and to we P.F. Got Chang's, the... and we were actually, we ordered our food, and the food just had come. And I got a phone a call. call. Yeah. It was and like 6.30 yeah. at night. And it was, it was Aunt Ruth. Aunt Ruth, was, great, my great Aunt Ruth. Oh. Right? Oh. And and she was very sick. And she goes, she goes. I gotta go. I, you know, my my aunt's she's sick. She's in the hospital. I'm like, oh. I have to. And yeah. I didn't even eat yet. Did I? Oh. Do we? No. I guess no, we, we we didn't eat. And oh. and I said, I was like, sure, bye. You want me to come with you? She goes. Yeah. I was like, really? Okay. Wow, cool. And, so he ended up helping I me with the car. Drove nice. over there and then I just sat in the car because you know. Like, I don't, I, you hey, know, you had yourself a real challenge. Challenge. That's right. <laughs> right. So then so Aunt I Ruth. The car. Yeah, right. so then I went into the emergency room. My ex boyfriend was the ER doctor, Bruce Millman. <laughs> so I felt comfortable. He told me she's going to be okay. If she needs a ride home. Can you take her? So then I went and back to the car, oh, maybe. Was, uh, whatever the other lady, the, her friend. Ida was there. Yeah. Her oh, friend came back with us. No, maybe I think Ida was gone then. Was it Ida? No. Anyway. So it was her friend, whatever the lady oh, was. Okay. She went and she got in our car. I, oh, I think someone would Oh. Yeah, she got in our car. Oh, that's right. The, oh, that's right. Not Aunt Ruth. Aunt Ruth is in the hospital. She was staying yes. and she was ill. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so her I spoke with the doctor. There. She got in our car. Yeah. We were taking and then we took her home, the roommate or the friend. And she was, she was and telling she me goes, in certain terms that I was a keeper. Yeah, she goes, he's a keeper. <laughs> And then was she didn't know it was our first day. No, no, Ruth was still in the hospital. She was sick, so mm-hmm. I had gone to see her. And then the friend had been visiting, or somehow she didn't have a ride home. So we drove her friend home. And oh, then, and then the, the friend was like, he's a nice gentlemanly boy. And that was he's our first day. with a K. Yeah, and that was kind of it. And then 